My name's Sam Binstead and I'm a slow fashion and portrait photographer based in Sheffield. What inspires me to take photos and videos are usually the people in them. Uh, I do focus a lot of my work on makers and creatives, uh, the people and the process behind the product, as well as obviously a bit of product comes with the territory. But rather than it just being all about selling and product, it's about tracing the craft and tracing where things have come from and trying to work that into my images. My journey into content creation started with advocacy for slower fashion, information and sharing cool, interesting brands, and then slowly but surely my love for photography and my love for sustainability merged, and I just focused on creating images for slower ethical makers. So today's shoot is for some jewellery. There's actually a jeweller based in the same studio as where my photography studio is, here at Yorkshire Art Space. And the look that I really wanted to achieve is to mirror the sort of warm tones in the gold of the jewels. So we've gone for a nice monochromatic palette with lots of pink hues in there. The main visual inspiration came from the fact that they were just cutting down a load of grass outside the uh, studio. Some beautiful landscaping, cutting it back for the season and I just went and rescued a load of it and thought I'd build a set around that. The Atomos monitor that I've selected for today's shoot is the Ninja V Plus. The additional features such as focus peaking and false colours for setting my exposure that allow me to quickly jump between photo and video on a bit of a run and gun element when I don't have a crew available to help the video production run smoothly and I'm on my own, those little things can really help get the video done to a better quality. One of the most valuable features of the Atmos monitor that I used today was simply the frame guidelines. Being able to comfortably shoot in 16.9 without needing to re-rig the camera or flip anything around, but pre-visualizing that extraction for a social vertical video is really great. A monitor like the Ninja really helps my business by allowing me to confidently upsell video packages to my photography clients. Having the equipment to efficiently deliver quality video without trying to sell the client on a full videography project separate to the stills can be really valuable for both you and the client. Personally for me, Atomos are the only choice for a camera monitor. And with the Ninja V Plus, the future-proofing of 8K compatibility, if I do decide to upgrade my video body anytime soon, is just a really great place to be.